recording. Hi everybody, this is Bill with Bill and Carol's Travel Project. I just love the red rock. Love the red rock. Red rock. There's a house. You're thinking of red rum, red rum. Look at that. Alright, so for today's ride, we're headed over to Tell Your Ride. Tell Your Ride, Colorado. I don't know if you've ever been there. Let me know. But they have these free gondola rides, and uh, we're going to check it out. Yeah, so we didn't actually drive into the town of Telluride. We parked our bikes at a little place called Mountain Village, where we can catch this uh, gondola. Supposedly will take us into Telluride, and then we don't have to fight the hustle and bustle, finding parking spots in uh, downtown Telluride. Place up here 40 years ago. All right, so this is the end of the first gondola ride, and you have to get off here. You can turn around and go back down, but we got off. We don't know really what we're doing here. Well, there's there's not a lot of instructions on how to get around, but we're getting on the second gondola. Are you gonna stop? No, you just jump on. <laughs> Okay, as we make our graceful entrance into the second gondola, um, we're heading on up the hill. We think there's a restaurant up there. Don't, don't smile too much, Kira. <laughs> okay, as we approach our third interchange, you know, we're not sure what to do. I guess we will uh, get off, and I don't know if we're going to get on another gondola or if we're going to eat here. I'm just not sure. So as we come into the port, you know, they don't stop the thing. They just slow it down, and you jump off. So here goes Barry out the door. And then, uh, hell, I'm kind of shoving Carol out the door. Let's go. And as I step out, this lady, she tells us, if y'all are going to town, you better get back in. Well, like I said, there's not a lot of instructions here. Um, now, there's Barry. We're going to meet him in, in a little bit. But, um, yeah, we all got off here like we knew what we were doing. <laughs> and and uh, that girl was hollering, you want a map? You want a map? We said, no, we just want to go to town. We get back in there. <laughs> so, yeah, we dismounted and then we remounted. Excuse me. There's Tell You Ride. Yeah, I hope they got the back pressure valve on this thing. It was yeah, so what we learned uh, on that leg of the gondola, it's pretty surprising. You don't have to get off. You just stay on it. And this thing actually makes a 90-degree turn. So you think it's the end, but when it turns, this is what you see. You see the village of Tell You Ride. And, uh, man, the views are just fantastic. So uh, I suggest if you want to come to Telluride and do something for free that's worth it, come ride this gondola. Man, I'm just amazed at the, at the sights that we're seeing from here. Well, I guess one of the main focuses of our trip is to have lunch. And if you go with Barry, you always find a, uh, a little brewery. So this is Telluride Brewing Company. 
All right, so after a, a really good lunch, we find our way down on the main street looking around. Um, if you look up on this hill, you'll see there's a waterfall, Bridal Veil Falls. You can't see it very good, but there's a power generating station right at the top of that falls. It's uh, hydroelectric. So uh, I guess it's, we can't afford anything here, so we're going to make our way on back to the bikes. All right, we just got off the gondola. We've had a pretty good day here in Telluride. If you're ever in this area, that's kind of a fun thing to do for the day. And in Telluride, there's not that much things that are free. And uh, trust me, we paid for that with our lunch, but <laughs> it was a good lunch. It was fun. Hey everybody, I want to introduce y'all to somebody. Y'all saw a glimpse of him today in the gondola, but um, you know, we're camped over here and uh, Carol and I, our hobby is riding motorcycles. And it just so happened that, uh, yeah, our neighbor. Now this guy I'd like y'all to meet Barry Farrell. Hi y'all. Barry, where are you from? I'm from Winters, Texas. Now, why would I come to Colorado and meet a guy from Winters, Texas? I don't know, he's been a very interesting fellow. You got anything to say to everybody? Uh, just getting out of the heat. Yeah. <laughs> Texas let's, heat. Let's uh, let's take a look at your equipment. Now, I tell you what, old Barry, he's tougher than boot leather. Barry's doing the things I did back when I was about 25 years old. He's, uh, he's camping in his tent. You know, he's 700 miles from home. He's been gone for a couple of weeks. He just, he's just getting away from things. But I want, to, I want to show you his equipment here. Check out this Corvette he was driving down here. Mary, tell us about this, uh, what you got here. That's, that is cool. This is a 2012 car replica trailer. You look up car replica trailer, this is what you'll find. They're, they're uh, sold in Michigan. There was a retailer in Texas where I bought this, but he's no longer retailing. So this is a storage compartment just a, a storage trailer it's got 25 cubic foot of storage in it so i can put my tent all my all my stuff in there and it toes behind the, the bike you don't even feel it unless you hit a bump yeah. i mean it, and it's a it's a corvette is the what it's modeled after and that's it looks like he's hauling a little corvette on a car trailer now this is what does all the work right here. This is uh, what year model? 2008. 2008 Gold Wing. Barry, well, Barry, I'm gonna let you tell the story. How many states you've been in? And well, this this Gold Wing, which I've named Raven, has been in 49 states, uh, three provinces of Canada, and uh, down in Mexico. So I had to rent a bike in Hawaii, but it's uh, we've been in all 49 states and now we're doubling up and going back to, to a few of them that we like. There you go. I'll just kind of go around the bike and let you see it. Yeah, pretty nice bike. So, of course, you can, here's, here's Barry's tent where he hangs out. And you know, it's kind of in our front yard. So yeah, it's kind of lucky that uh, this guy's in our front yard because, man, we've had a heck of a good time. We've been riding around the mountains over to uh, the Million Dollar Highway. We rode over to tell you ride today. We've had, we've had a pretty good time. So uh, it's kind of funny how you meet some interesting people. Just wanted to introduce Barry. Thank you.